comes to the mouse village. I'll knit a scarf for cute Matty. Grandma knits it every day. I've finished. Will Matty like this scarf? Isn't it too long for him? Grandma worries about it. The next day, Grandma calls Matty to her house. Matty, this scarf is for you. I hope you like this. It looks warm. Thank you, Grandma. Matty wears the scarf. But the scarf is very long. Grandma, it's too long for me, says Matty. But that's all right, Grandma. I am too small for it, says Matty. Grandma is sad. I will cut this into pieces for Matty. I'll make the scarf shorter, Grandma thinks. At that time, a bell rings. Ding, 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 ding. Grandma hears the bell ringing. Three little mice fell off the cliff, a mouse cries. Everyone hears the bell ringing. Ding, 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 ding. Hurry up. Let's go and save them. The mice in the village run to the cliff. Some mice take a ladder, but the ladder is too short to save the little mice. At that time, Matty thinks of Grandma's scarf. The long scarf might be helpful. Matty runs to Grandma. Matty carries the scarf with his friends. Hey, hold this scarf, Matty shouts to the little mice. The little mice hold the scarf tightly. Let's pull together, says Matty. All the mice Pull the scarf. Finally, the little mice get up the cliff safely. They run to their mummy and daddy. It's all thanks to your scarf, Grandma, says Matty. Today is a special day. It's a picnic day. Grandma cuts the long scarf into pieces and gives them to the other mice. Oh, it's very warm and nice. Grandma is very happy.